Chapter 11 The Earth and the Moon Science Word Pile Let us first study meanings of some important words in this chapter. Atmosphere Planet Earth is surrounded by an envelope of gases which is called its atmosphere. Rotation Movement around an axis. Axis An imaginary line around which a body rotates. Revolution Motion in orbit or a circular path. New Moon When we cannot see the light of the moon at all. Crescent Moon When moon appears in curved sickle shape. Full Moon When whole lighted face of the moon is seen. The Earth The Earth is, well, like an orange. Don't laugh, it is. It is big, round, and slightly flattened at the poles, just like an orange. To us, the earth looks flat, but it is actually not so. We know that the earth is round because people have sailed around it. They went sailing on and on till they finally came back to the very same place from where they had started. Did you know that? The earth is about 81 times heavier than the moon. Ho oh, ho! I am heavier than you! The earth is about 50 times bigger in size than the moon. I am larger than you. Now when there is an eclipse of the moon, the earth throws a round shadow on the moon. We know that shadows have the same shapes and forms as the object that causes them. So it proves that the earth is round. Have you ever seen a ship sailing? Well, you will notice that when a ship sails away from the shore, first the hull, that is, the lower part of the ship, disappears from sight. Gradually, the middle part of the ship becomes invisible. Finally, the top of the mast, that is the flagpole, disappears. This can take place only on a rounded surface. If the earth was flat, the whole ship would have gone out of sight at the same time, would it not have? Hmm, so the earth is not flat, it is round. People who have gone to the moon have taken photographs of the earth from their spaceships. These photographs have also shown the earth to be round. Surface of the earth The surface of the earth is made up of land and water. There are three parts of water and one part of land on the surface of the earth. The earth is surrounded by a layer of air. This layer of air is called atmosphere. Day and night The earth is like a top because it is spinning on its axis all the time. It spins 
from west to east. It goes round once in 24 hours. The spinning of the earth on its axis is called the rotation of the earth. The earth gets its light from the sun. The sun shines all the time, but only half of the earth faces the sun at a time, and that half of the earth which faces the sun has day. The other half of the earth that is away from the sun has night. As the earth rotates slowly, the lighted part moves generally away from the sun and has night. The dark part comes to face the sun and has day. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. So the places in the east see the sun before the places in the west. Now that is why Japan is called the land of the rising sun. Let us understand for ourselves how day and night occur, shall we? Activity Take a globe and place it on a table. Light a candle and place it at the other end of the table. The half of the globe which is facing the candle is lighted. In fact, what it means is that it has day. The other half which is away is dark, so it has night. Turn the globe slowly from left to right. You will find the lighted parts going away into darkness and the dark parts coming into light. Now this is exactly what happens to our earth. And that's how we have day and night. Did you know when it is day in Japan, it is still night in England. In the same way, India is to the east of America. When it is day in India, it is night in America. And when it is day in America, it becomes night in India. Isn't it fun? Moon Facts Nothing grows on the moon. Yes, really. The soil has no plant or animal remains. The surface of the moon has many big holes which are called craters. The moon orbits the earth at an average speed of 3,700 kilometers per hour. The moon You must have seen the moon shine brightly at night. It is also round. The moon is smaller than the earth. Sometimes the moon and the sun seem to be of the same size. But this is because the moon is nearer to us and the sun is very far away. In reality, the moon is much smaller than the sun. The moon goes round the earth. It takes the moon 28 days to go round the earth once. Like the earth, the moon has no light of its own. So how does it shine? Well, the moon shines 
when light from the sun falls on it. One half of the moon which is facing the sun is lighted. The rest of the moon is in darkness. Changes in the shape of the moon The earth and the moon are always moving in relation to the sun, so they keep changing their position. That is why we do not always see the bright side of the moon completely. Sometimes we see the bright side fully. Sometimes we do not see the bright side at all. At other times, we see the moon partly bright and partly dark. That is why Every day the moon appears to change its shape in the sky. When the moon lies between the sun and the earth, we do not see its lighted face at all. It is called a new moon. Man on Moon Man first set foot on the moon on July 20th, 1969. The first man on the moon was Neil Armstrong of USA. The spacecraft was called the Apollo 11. Astronauts walk easily on the moon even though they wear heavy equipment. This is because they feel light because the force of gravity on the moon's surface is one-sixth that of Earth. A boy or girl who weighs 60 kgs on Earth would weigh only 10 kgs on the moon. Imagine that! Crescent and Full Moon We see only a part of its lighted face when the sun and the moon are at an angle. It is called a crescent moon. When the earth lies between the sun and the moon, we see the whole of its lighted face. It is called a full moon.